I think you look back and it, you think, well, it was a big deal, but at the time, I, it doesn't really register, I don't think. That's not why I was in the racing, to try to have that. It didn't, I raced because it was just fun to do it, not because I wanted to see my name up there somewhere. I never went out and asked one sponsor for anything. I never, I wasn't trying to do that. I just wanted to go racing. I just wanted to compete and have fun. I'd always wanted to race cars of some sort and didn't know what I wanted to race. My business got going and became a little bit successful. First thing I did was went out and I bought a motorcycle. I went out and entered my very first desert race on a motorcycle in the novice class. And did that for about three years and was really enjoying it and having a good time. And a friend of mine said, hey, we should go race a buggy. He had just come back from the Mint 400. I thought it was a great idea, never seen one, didn't know anything about them. And I says, well, I'll share the cost with you. So he up and ordered a brand new Funko, and we drove it less than three miles to check it out and headed off to Baja 500. That was it. Once I did that, then motorcycles kind of became a thing of the past. And that's what started up was the, the conversion, not knowing what I was going to do. Oh, I can still remember this day, going down there, pulling in, and I jumped in in that thing and I'm, I'm driving it and all of a sudden I just, I'm, I'm thinking to myself, I, I just can't believe it. This is the best thing that's ever happened to me. The, t the tires to me were, I mean, they were instrumental over the years as far as the success that I had. All of my major wins came on BF Goodrich tires. Tires are one of, by far, one of the most important things in, in, in racing, period. That was such an advantage. I think on most of the Baja 1000s, I, I don't even remember having a flat. And I could relate it exactly to a race. Don't worry about the guy that comes out fast in the very beginning. We gotta make it a thousand miles. You were leading, but at what sacrifice? You know, you can't get away with it. The race is a thousand miles, it's not a hundred miles. Who got the trophy at the end? You know, that, that, that's what, everybody's gonna remember that. Nobody else cares about the excuses. That's the mentality of off-road racing.